Hey guys, welcome to the show. Today we're going to be setting up HTTPS access to your local host on your Mac OS system. Now you might be having local host as normal HTTP and it works because you got Apache installed but now we're going to be allowing you to do HTTPS by default it will say this site can't be reached. Now first up I'm going to say we're not doing this in a secure way we're just going to be getting this up and running for a development environment because some websites for example Facebook I got a beautiful app Facebook here if I want to use the Facebook API it requires me to use HTTPS as a callback for some reason they don't allow localhost even for local development so you need to set up localhost anyway I'm on macOS I'm going to show you exactly how to do that so first up I'm fired up terminal and you want to open up your text editor to your HTTP D config file once you got that loaded up you want to search for server name and you want to change server name to localhost get rid of that hash and then you want to go into mod v host alias and you want to uncomment that guy so just remove that hash from the beginning as well as httpd v hosts you want to enable that guy and next up we're going to be modifying the v hosts file and you want to replace the entire contents of the file with this bad boy boom server name localhost which is the one we just defined you give it the document root this is where I store my index files but you can store it anywhere else you give it directory this is where I store my files you can of course store it somewhere else but that is that set up there and now you want to restart Apache now Apache is restarted you want to configure your SSL business so I'm gonna make a directory called SSL in my Apache 2 installation directory and then I need to generate a private key as well as a certificate for my site. So I'm going to call sudo open SSL gen RSA output to localhost key. Boom, it's made. We're happy. Now we're going to request the certificate. sudo open SSL request new key there output into the same directory. Everyone's happy. So now we need to add the certificate to our keychain access done just that line of code pseudo security add trusted cert d you know that kind of stuff. you can see it on the screen you know what's going on now within terminal you want to edit your http d again so that's fired that back up and now we want to uncomment this module mod so cache that business over there mod ssl that one over there and you want to include httpd.ssl so again just search for that there include done we're getting places in the world so close that guy down open up the v hosts again so as you can see firstly localhost is port 80 ssl https is port 443 so paste that in there pretty much exactly the same as that except we've got SSL enabled for this guy again document root is your document root and directory is your directory but everything else is pretty much the same close that up now we want to open up httpd SSL that config file and you want to replace the service certificate file and the service certificate key with the one you just made so I'm going to comment out this fella and I'm going to point it to my own one localhost the one we just made the key that we just made slightly earlier on and the key file search for that and i'm going to comment out the default one that points to server.key and replace it with localhost.key which is the one i just made remember back here localhost.key that's what i just made that's what i'm replacing it with and we want to change our listing port from 8443 which is the the, the debug one over to 443 because we want to make this one live and we want to search for our server name and make that guy called localhost as well localhost that's it that is it that's all you need to do to get SSL running so I'm just gonna now restart my Apache and fingers crossed it will work there you go command prompt says fine so now 
we're going to go over into the world of this site cannot be reached we're going to hit refresh and there you go google chrome is complaining that we have an invalid certificate so what you want to do is proceed and it works so while it isn't a proper SSL, it doesn't have the correct certificate. You can use this one for debugging. So for example, I have an application here, connects to Facebook, and it has a HTTPS callback. And boom, it's made a callback, but there's a bug in my code, which I need to debug. But there it is, HTTPS has been enabled on your Mac OS computer. Let me know if you found this video useful, and if you'd like to learn how I installed HTTP in the first place, Apache, let me know. I can also do a tutorial for that. Basically, I just used Brew, but if you need guidance, always here to help. Hope you guys found this video useful and enjoyed the amazing commentary show.